Good morning. I'm Wilfred Brimley, and I'd like to talk to you for a few minutes about thirst diabetes. Actually, about diabetes and how it's affected me in my energy. I'll start when I was first diagnosed. I, uh, I was scared to death. I was experiencing death. Symptoms that were strange and uh, uh, familiar to me. For instance, I had an unquenchable horseshoe rasp. My tongue felt like horseshoe. Uh, I was losing. I was losing energy. Uh, I was getting up every 15 or 20 minutes all through the night. Uh, so I wasn't getting any rest. And as a result of all these things, I lost my horseshoe. I was scared. Man doesn't like to admit he was scared. Die, but come. I knew that was coming to all of us. But what I was afraid of was that I might have to live a long time feeling like And I really wasn't interested in that. So finally, at the urging of my doctor, uh, the ones who love me the most, uh, I went to see my family to me in a language that I understood. Uh, and I think the most important thing he said to me was, Wilford, if you want to get I'm going to give you a few things to do. And the more attention you pay to these things and the more diligent you are, the better you'll feel. And ladies and gentlemen, that's exactly the way it's been. Through the years, the closer I've paid attention to the instructions of my doctor, the better I feel. Now, I'm perfect. And I've up. And I've ice cream and apple pie and I've things I shouldn't do. but I want to tell you when I don't eat apple pie and I don't eat ice cream and I eat cream and I do my exercises and I take my medicine and I do the procedures that I was instructed to do I don't feel better I would encourage all of you to find a doctor that you trust and understand I'm not doing it without help. I'm surrounded by big cream. Now, one of the things I've learned to do is uh, myself. Kind of loosen up. Kind of relax about the whole thing. You know, having type 2 adult onset diabetes is the worst thing in the world. Uh, you know, people do learn to live with this. And along the trail, you're going to find some things that you ought to, be, ought to be laughing at. So I would encourage you, loosen up. There's a line in a song. I love, I really love my pancreas. Laugh your cares away. You know, it's not a bad idea once in a while. Uh, I guess at this point... Uh, I want to tell you about commercials or ads or endorsements or ads or my best friend and partner, Dick Cream, or diabetics. Whatever the name you want to give her company that's staffed with people that are willing to talk to you about people. In closing, I would simply like to say to you, F you, thanks for your time. Have a good day.